So uh, brace yourself. The realness. Rosenberg is about to drop something too real on us. I hate to take you to a different place, Ebro. This isn't a place I like to take you. But this weekend, we got the verdict in the Michael Dunn trial. The man who shot an unarmed, actually four unarmed black teens, um, one of which Jordan Davis was killed. This weekend, And this was because their music was too loud. Well, yes, he asked them to turn down the music. At first they turned it down, then Jordan Davis was like, nah, turn that back up. At which point he claims to have seen a gun, there was no gun, mm -hmm. and then he fired multiple shots into the car and killed Jordan Davis over his music being loud. So this weekend he was convicted on four counts of attempted murder. They couldn't get him on the first degree murder. We'll see what happens with that. He is guaranteed to do some jail time. However, the clip I'm about to play you of him talking from jail is going to make you really wish he was convicted of that first degree murder. This is Michael Dunn, the man who killed an unarmed teenager, talking about how he is the true victim. It's like, I'm the f***ing victim here. I was the one who was victimized. What? <laughs> I mean, I, I, I don't know how, how else to put it. Like, they attacked me. I, I'm the victim. I'm the victor, but I was the victim, too. I was the one that was being preyed upon, and I fought back. It's not quite the same, but it made me think of, like, the old TV shows and movies where, um, how the police used to think when a chick got raped. They're like, oh, it's her fault because the way she was dressed. So it's my fault because I asked them to turn their radio down. It's like, I got attacked. And I fought back because I didn't want to be a victim, and now I'm in trouble. Wow. How was he attacked? That is... How was he attacked? If you were wondering what Michael Dunn sounded like and what his thoughts were on that issue. Shiny culture. Oh, that's, that's horrible. ridiculous. He's believing his own nonsense. You know, any of the stuff that he's saying, all of the evidence that he's trying to use on his side is unreal. There was no guns found. There was no attack. He was the one that was attacking and is now believing his own BS. Ebro, how do you feel about this? I'm just happy he's going to jail. I'm trying. Actually, I've... That was before. Keep in mind. That was before you heard the snickering and stuff. Yeah. That was before he got time. This was recorded before. Now you're going to jail. Are so. you snickering? Right, yeah. It's funny. And we're going to see if... Uh, Tiny and them in the next cell. Yes. Think it's cute. Mm -hmm. See if they want to snicker about it. Anyways, that's the realness.